All right, welcome back to the channel, man. Crypto Tro. I am Crypto Tro, bringing you the latest and the greatest in cryptocurrencies for beginners. And today, I'm bringing you another episode of Web 3.0. You know, showing you how to get into different things such as DeFi, showing you how to create liquidity pools. And today on this specific episode, I know previous episodes, my previous video, I talked about Harmony and any swap. And today I'm just going to go do an overview on any swap and just show you guys, you know, the different dashboards, the swap the pool and the form sections of the platform and just show you how if you have Bitcoin, how you can convert your Bitcoin to different things on different blockchains, such as ETH blockchain, Harmony blockchain and many more. So stay tuned, man. And I'm get straight into it. But before I do, make sure you hit that like, hit that subscribe button, man. I appreciate everybody for tuning in. Y'all are some real ones. And also, make sure you follow me on Twitter right now, man. Stop what you're doing. Follow me on Twitter, tro underscore crypto. And I just be dropping, you know, insider's information, just things on my personal perspective on the crypto space and also just personal things as well just a little insider into what's going on in crypto trolls mind so i drop gems on twitter as well so follow me on twitter and also i got a discord coming soon now I'll, I'll and i will put the twitter links in my bio and also when i drop my discord i'm gonna promote that as well but enough with everything else man we're gonna get straight into it so today like i said we're talking about any swap and pretty much the website is anyswap.exchange. So when you go on anyswap.exchange, it takes you pretty much to this pass point right here. So I just got to put my MetaMask password in. So now I'm entered on MetaMask. And as you can see, my MetaMask wallet, this is my currently my MetaMask wallet. And I'm currently on the ETH mainnet. So right now I got about a uh, 0.01 worth of ETH. That's like, uh, I don't know, like $40, something like that. Let's see. I don't even got to get. So that's $41 right now. And that's not really a lot to play with. Um, but I'm just going to go over. I ain't really going to show you too much. I just want to go over the any swap and show you the potentials of any swap. Like I said, this is not financial advice at all. You always have to do your own research on any project. Like I just want to show you how you can use this as a bridge, you know. And also let me go back one step. I want to go back to their Twitter and um you know show you a couple of things on twitter so right now i'm on their twitter page and it's the any swap network and it's pretty much any swap is a trustless protocol to bridge access between heterogeneous layer one and layer two platforms so it's a fairly new project we scroll down and we can see any swaps latest ecosystem in a supported chains they have 17 supported chains and 456 supported tokens so we're going to click on this and just see everything that any swap supports and their name pretty much goes with what they are trying to do any swap man so you can pretty much swap anything major on here i like that they have the binance smart chain swap and then you know the ETH and the Polygon, then the Phantom, then Heco, Avalanche, Bitcoin, Harmony One, and many, many more. And look at all these tokens that they support on the blockchain, man. That is crazy. I think any swap could potentially be a good swap to use, especially for a bridge. Right now, a lot of people are trying to come up with bridges. I know the Harmony One protocol team is really um working hard to find a bridge, but any swap has already created uh, this uh, some type of bridge already. So this is major in my eyes. Um, just moving forward, seeing how AnySwap has these variety of cryptocurrencies on their swap exchange. So that's there. If you want to follow them on Twitter, you can follow them. These are pretty much their tweets and who they've been partnering with. Um, I'm not going to go too much in detail on that. But if you want to also get to the exchange, you can go to the exchange on their Twitter account. So in their bio, you can see the AnySwap.exchange and you just click on that link in your MetaMask app and it'll take you directly to the website just in case you don't know what to type in. 
you can just go directly on Twitter and just follow them. And then, you know, you don't even got to follow them. You can just click the link. And I also want to say I'm not sponsored by them. I just want to make this video just to show you guys how you can do a potential bridge from Bitcoin to Harmony One or to ETH or to whatever the case may be, but just showing you how to get to that particular bridge. So we go back to it. And also the way you the way you switch bridges at the top right hand corner, you see right now we're on the ETH mainnet. Um, just because I got like a couple of dollars in there, but you also have the Fusion mainnet, Binance Smart Chain main, mainnet, Phantom mainnet. And, you know, just all the different main nets that we have right here. So these are all the different main nets that you can access through any swap. So now this is the dashboard, like I said, and it shows you your balances on your different coins. Then it also shows you if you have liquidity provided on the different coins. So right now I'm going to go to the swap, which is next. So I'm on the ETH and I can switch it to, you know, any swap ETH or any BTC or Fusion or Litecoin or Chainlink USDC. You know, we can see all of these different things we can potentially change it to on any swap. And it's a lot of them, man. It's just, it's a lot of things on any swap on the ETH mainnet that you can swap with. Um, but particularly, I probably would only swap with any BTC because though any BTC is pretty much how you bridge it over. So just say, for instance, um, any BTC can easily convert to Bitcoin. So I'm going to show you guys one time, you know, how you do it. And also make sure you guys read this, man. Make sure you guys read. So this is the swap. Um, like I said, I think it's you have to have a certain amount before you can swap it. Um, it has to be like you know, higher amount. I know when I tried to do it on Harmony One's mainnet, I was playing around with it before, like before I got in this video and I got too excited and I end up sending like $200 worth of Bitcoin to the bridge. But the shocker was you have to send $400 or 0 0.01, which is $400 worth of Bitcoin. And I'm gonna get to that. But this is just a swap. Um, now we go to the pool. If you want to make a liquidity pool or add liquidity for the pools this is where you go to add liquidity and then this is the bridge so this was our this is where i was talking about um this where you would deposit your bitcoin you would copy this bitcoin address and you know of course paste it into whatever exchange you're sending it from or you know whatever place you're sending it from and then you know send it to here but reading is fundamental guys reading is fundamental and I did not use my fundamentals, guys. So I always make sure you read. Never get over joy and uh, too excited like I did because I was doing it on the mobile phone, but I did not scroll down and actually read the reminder. So now I'm on the computer and I see that. Wait, they just changed it, though, because at first the minimum uh, deposit amount was 0.01. One, I guess I think on the Harmony One's magnet. So let me just change it um to Harmony One magnet and let's see. Yeah, so on Harmony on Harmony's um blockchain, maybe I should have sent it on ETH, guys. Hey, that's another thing because on ETH it was 0 0.001, but on the Harmony magnet is 0 0.01. So I end up sending like two hundred dollars and 0 0.01 of Bitcoin is about $470, somewhere around there. So I'm, I guess I'm just kind of looked out right now, but I mean, it is what it is, 200 uh, down the drain, but I didn't want to send any more. I didn't want to send 400 more um, because I was, you know, was planning on stake, continue to stake that money. Um, but if you wanted to, you know, like I said, use at your own risk this is not financial advice do your own research on this project and it tells you use at your own risk and it's a beta project but you know if you have four hundred dollars to spare and i think this might this gotta be they gotta change it soon man i believe so to lure it to get more people to enter onto the exchange and it's probably just a coding thing what i gotta work on to be able to handle you know so low fees and get more liquidity onto the project but right now it's a standard of around 0 0.01 bitcoin and it's going to be from around you know 380 dollars to 400 dollars right as of right now until the price goes up so the price is fluctuating around that area and that is how much you will have to send 
But if you wanted to use the bridge, all you have to do is send your Bitcoin to your BTC address. And then just the pot, when it deposit, it's going to show you the amount. And then when it shows you the amount, you know, you deposit it into Bitcoin and then you convert it into any BTC, if that makes sense. So you deposit in a Bitcoin and you convert it into any BTC. And then you go to the swap. And then once you convert it to any BTC, you can now convert your any BTC into things on Harmony One's blockchain. So right now on Harmony One's mainnet is one any BTC, beefy finance, rap ETH, and that's pretty much it. So those are the things that's on the one mainnet. Um, but I showed you ETH mainnet as well, and it has multiple options that you can choose from. You just got to decide on, you know, which particular crypto that you want to choose. Um, but you have multiple options to choose from. And that's how you pretty much use it as a Bitcoin bridge. Now, I know this was multiple steps, um, so I'm going to space it out, of course, in the time codes below. Make sure you check out the time codes below or the time stamps below um, just to get a better understanding of it. But yeah, this is pretty much how you how you will use a btc bridge and any swap is pretty much you know and any swap is pretty much you know solving that problem for us making that bridge uh for btc um the only thing is it's a barrier you gotta have four hundred dollars if you are on the harmony mainnet um but i wish i would have seen it on each mainnet because it's um uh less than four hundred dollars it's actually like forty forty dollars yeah forty dollars so I don't know why it's 0.01 on, on Harmony's mainnet. Maybe because it's fairly new, um, but it is what it is. So that's the bridge. Um, like I said, that's if you have Bitcoin you, and you want to convert, or if you have Beefy, Wrap ETH, Wrap Bitcoin, Wrap Matic, um, whatever you have, you want to convert it and you want you want to deposit it and then you know convert it to any Bitcoin. From there, you can convert your any Bitcoin to whatever the case may be. So then, boom, we go down to farm. So farms, these are pretty much all of the different forms that any swap has to offer uh, i'm not gonna go in too much into detail in them because i don't know the particular forms um but you can see all of the forms that they currently have and you know just go into detail or go into research for yourself and just see if they offer anything good but i couldn't tell you on the forms i'm really not trying to open any new positions up on anything so i don't want to just go deep dive all the way into their farming section but these are just all of them that they have. So you can check it out yourself and see if they have something that you would like and that, you know, uh, you would deem a good investment for yourself. So that's my video for today, man. Crypto Tro, you know what I'm saying? Just giving you some ways that you can use your Bitcoin if you wanted to convert it uh, and bridge it over to other assets. And it's this way is kind of easy. I like it was it's it's very simple. I feel like it's easier than the Harmony's Bridge because um, I was kind of confused on Harmony's Bridge at first, but I get it now. Um, but it was kind of easier than Harmony's Bridge. But at the end of the day, guys, you got to understand we are all here early. Like this is very early. And, you know, we're light years ahead right now. DeFi is going to explode and it's going to explode on a, on a mass consumer level. And the only way that can happen is if they make it easy for a consumer to use. And I believe someone's going to come around to make it easier and make these things more simpler. And we're going to already be ahead of the curve. We're going to already know if we're going to be OGs in the game. We're going to know how to already make liquidity pools and things of that nature. And it's going to be something that's so easy and we're so ahead of that we didn't already made those massive gains that people missed out on by not learning what's going on right now and cryptos are just happening DeFi is just happening bridges are just starting nfts are just starting so we just gotta stick it out and see what's ahead and see what's in store for the crypto space so like i said man i'm crypto tro and make sure you follow my crypto youtube page subscribe to my crypto youtube page and also follow my Twitter page, man, Tro underscore crypto. You know, I'm giving that content after content after content, man. And I appreciate everybody for tuning in and checking in with your boy. 
y'all some real ones, man. So, Crypto Tro, that's my video for today. I'm out of here.